What's going on guys, it's J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my Nightfall and Weekly Crucible loot from this past week on all three of my characters. So this week's Nightfall was the Blighted Chalice Strike with Malak. Pretty chill week overall for the Nightfall, especially with modifiers like Small Arms being active. But anyways, let's get straight into my loot for the week. Starting off with my Nightfall drops for my first character on my Hunter for the first one, we got a legendary armor piece on this one, and it was a helmet, 400 defense, pretty good, so definitely good infusion fuel on that first one. Moving on to my next Nightfall drop for the second one on my Warlock, we ended up getting another legendary on this one, and we got a weapon this time, it was the Parthian Shot, which is a pulse rifle. Came in at 400, the perks on it though weren't the greatest, so probably going to end up using that as infusion fuel as well. And then finally for my last Nightfall of the week, this one on my Titan. For the last one, we finally got an exotic and this time we got the super good advice exotic machine gun. So pretty good overall, it came in at 400 as well, definitely more a good infusion fuel. And then moving on to my Shaxx Crucible Bounties for the week. For the first one, we got a legendary primary on this one and it was the Cryptic Dragon. This is the Scout Rifle, came in at 400 attack with the perks Triple Tap and Outlaw. Down the middle we got Explosive Rounds, Injection Mold, and a Field Scout. So some decent perks on this one. Triple Tap is pretty good for PvE. We also got Outlaw, so not too bad on that first drop. Moving on to my next Bounty drop for the second one. We got another Legendary Weapon on this one, and it was the Machine Gun, the Unending Deluge. Came in at 400 as well with the perks Take a Knee and Hot Swap. Down the middle we got Perfect Balance, Injection Mold, and Rifled Barrel. Not the greatest perks on this machine gun though, and the Iron Banner one looks a lot better that you can purchase from Effort Eat, so probably going to stick with that one and use this one up for Infusion Fuel. And then for my last Shax Bounty for the week on my Hunter, for this one, it was sent straight to my Postmaster. I believe it was a primary because that was a slot that was full. And then taking a look at the Postmaster, it ended up being another Hopscotch Pilgrim, another primary. Came in at 400 as well and I also had my previous Hopscotch Pilgrim from last week's Nightfall video still in my Postmaster but this one came in with the perk Secret Round and Glass Half Full. Down the middle we got Speed Reload, Feather Mag and Small Bore. Uh, this one doesn't seem as good as the one I got on the previous week so probably just going to keep this one for more infusion fuel. But that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always stay tuned for my Iron Banner Awards for this past week as well. I'm going to have a video on that very soon as well so stay tuned for that and that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching once again and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace!